Whether it's the classic cars parked out front or its old neon sign, few things have changed at the Orleans Hotel in Orleans. That's a beautiful old building. The other constant? An atmosphere that makes guests feel right at home. It's not your ordinary hotel or motel. It's something that's just a little different. Marilyn and David Snodgrass unlocked the door to owning the Orleans Hotel late last year. They've lived in the area for years, but hadn't really been in the property. Once they stepped foot inside the door, the retired couple found a new business on their hands. It's the last thing we ever had on our minds. We were both retired and kind of footloose and fancy free. The hotel was built by investors in 1929 to house many of the traveling salesmen who would visit Orleans to stop at then what was the world's largest creamery. Now guests enjoy many of the hotel's same features that remain unblemished since that time. I actually couldn't believe my eyes when I saw the dining room, the woodwork, and all that. Marilyn and David have created themes throughout the hotel's 23 rooms. Quilts created by his mom and grandma adorn each bed. The nice thing about it is that he can do a lot of this work around here, and it's kind of amazing. So there's a lot of talent. And I make him less. Antiques and other items remind guests of days gone by. The times may change, but this place to find a good night's rest hasn't. For this week's One Tank Trip, Zachary Chi, Orleans.